the LGBTs in there like that, a real bootleg, it's not ideal at all, uh, in fact, this whole setup is not really ideal, um, though I've tried to get it <laughs> about as best as I could, uh, because I was being lazy, so, number one, I should expect these to fail, um, it shouldn't run any mode, totally fine, they're gonna fail, um, the layout is not good, other than that, I think everything's about right, although I have not scoped the GDT um, in this arrangement. problem is I got some pretty good strikes off this thing, so I decided to let it go out the side, and then, it, man, within like five seconds it died because uh, it was doing ground strikes, so I'm going to try to just let it go out the top and see see how long it survives. <laughs> then if I, pop, if I pop these two, I'm probably going to have to get serious with the uh, last two that I've got for now. See, it kind of still wigs out um, when it really starts getting to uh, decent arcs. It starts going pop, pop, pop with these deep, um, high on time arcs, which is not good doesn't maintain this the steady on time so I need to figure that out <laughs> so you can kind of see maybe why it died when I let the arc go out to the side because when I put the breakout point to the side basically that crazy cloud of shit went all the way out 
and straight down the ground plane as well as this bootleg strike rail I made which is not ideal and I, I might even hit the cat too so I don't know that and that combined with one of the rectifiers on the input popping somehow that fucker died and I didn't even run it as long as I just did